Our direct variation means that y equals some constant times x squared. That's what it means for y to vary directly with x. The square of x, I'm sorry. To vary directly with z means it equals some constant, some different constant times z. And to vary inversely with the square of w means that it is equal to some constant divided by w squared. Now your question here is, do you have to have separate equations or just one? Well, they want one equation, just one equation. So we can put all of these together, and we can get rid of all these different constants. And we can write k. That constant might be, it doesn't matter if you're multiplying all these constants together, it's still going to be some constant times x squared times z, all divided by w squared. So that equation right there is a general equation where y varies directly with x squared and with z, and it varies inversely with w squared.